on Saturday the 3rd of October, it's been a while since I've done a video um, and I'm going to show you around at home because I've got most of my stuff's home now. Um, obviously the allotments, there's nothing going on, only bits and bats. But I'll show you around now what I've done and what I've brought home and I'll show you what's left in my garden. Okay guys. Right, quickly in my storeroom, this is my north facing pantry, which I completely love and would never get rid of. All the onions are now home. Okay, I keep the blind down as well so that it um, keeps it cooling in here. All the garlic, look at all that. 60 odd cloves of garlic, I'm using it now. Um, we've got a big new ginger perm at the back going on. Um, potatoes are now home, sacks of potatoes, you'll have to excuse the bikes. Okay, I've got all my potatoes now. Um, I've got a few in a box because I um, I didn't have enough bags, so they're the Bartlett's, all the Bartlett roosters, um, and obviously I've got some um, King Edward in there. Okay, I have got my, tell you what, tell you what, yeah, let's put a bloody light on. <laughs> right, um, oregano, I've dried all my oregano off. And underneath the oregano is all the time, which I'll show you in a minute where all that's come from. But there is nothing nicer than oregano. Just cut it off and you will not be disappointed. Um, what else? I've made a load of um, chutneys, um, jams. Um, look at this. I make all these jams and the kids eat smart <laughs> So many jams. They won't eat my jam. They'll eat my strawberry jam, but I haven't had any strawberries this year, so I've had to go and buy this. The bloody irony. Uh, look at the jams I've got here. And the kids will only eat this. Um, blackberry jam. I think I've shown you all that. Um, for lunch, for tea actually, I'm making bruschetta al pomodoro. Bruschetta al pomodoro, which means tomato bruschetta. So the tomatoes out of me. Um, Greenhouse, this is a fantastic book if anyone can get their hands on it, Tessa Kiros, and it's 12, Tuscan cookbook, and that's what I'm on for lunch. Um, my shallots are now pickled, look at them beauties. Um, three big things of shallots, <laughs> which I can't wait to get into. I'm going to leave them for maybe another month or two so they, you know, mature, as it were. Right, and let's show you around outside. Nothing going on. It is a miserable day up north today. It's just been really foggy. Um, nothing much going on weather-wise. Okay, so you can see now that I've taken up all the time. All the oregano, cut it all back. I've cut the rosemary right back. A few bits going on. Steve and my lovely neighbours having a huge extension, which is absolutely gorgeous. I'm sure he won't mind me filming it. Um, Tarragon, I'm going to cut that back and dry it, and the fennel has now gone to seed. Strawberries, again, so like I said, there was no strawberries, they'll all be for next year. Um, I've pulled one of the gooseberry bushes up because I didn't need them all, and I've got one down there, which has been attacked by strawberry go uh, gooseberry sawfly, look at that. And I always thought they were early, not late, but clearly not. Bear tree is doing okay, doing very well actually. And I've got some autumn lettuces in um, all different types not too sure what they're called I can find out in a minute and I've got some there as well okay tomatoes looking good doing good um, what I've done is I've trimmed all of the well most of the foliage back you know but not bad we haven't had a great year for tomatoes but you know what I'm not complaining I'm not complaining at all. Look at them beef steaks, Alicante, um, Gardener's Delight. Oh, look at that. Some of these are still flowering because we've had some great weather. But today has not, not been good at all. Yeah, uh, Cerise. Gorgeous Cerise there, Mylene, if you're listening. Really nice, beautiful when this, it's a sunny day and obviously you get the sun swim. So no, I'm not complaining with the tomatoes. But I just wanted to show you around because I haven't had you... I haven't done a video for a while. I don't want you thinking I've gone. I'm still here. Let me try and show you what they're called. So we've got Little Gem. Red Little Gem. I think that must be them. Um, Butterhead. And Red Salad Bowl. 
I think that's that. So, and I think they've just cost lettuces. I'm not sure. I think they don't mind a little bit of um, a little bit of. There you go. Stephen's extension. It's absolutely beautiful. It's going to be gorgeous when it's done. Look at me showing you all my washing on my line. <laughs> okay, guys. That's it. Just to let you know I'm still here and I've got a few bits going on. Okay, guys. That's it now. Speak to you all soon.